About half of Americans believe that the CIA was justified in its harsh interrogation methods of war on terror detainees. The U.S. Senate report concluded that CIA interrogation tactics were ineffective and often too brutal. The report said the interrogation included beatings, rectal rehydration, and sleep deprivation, and did not produce useful intelligence. The report accused them of violating professional ethics as architects of a system that committee chair Diane Feinstein said amounted to the torture of some CIA detainees. However, a Pew Research Center survey found that 51% of people in the U.S. believe the CIA's methods were justified, and 56% said the intelligence gathered from those methods prevented terrorist attacks. In an exclusive interview here at Net25, international law expert attorney Jeremy Gatdula suggested political bias may be behind this report, which was put together by the committee's Democratic majority. Um, medyo, I think, nag overact yung ibang tao about it. Eh. Kasi, um, isipin mo na lang kung Pilipinas yun, di ba? Tapos, alam mo, may mga mamamatay na mga kapwa mo Pilipino. Uh, I think, gagawin mo rin kung ano yung pinagagawa ng mga Amerikano do sa mga kaaway nila. Eh. Pero kasi, uh, i-examine natin muna yung, ano, yung ginamit mo kasing salita na torture, eh, which is yung ginamit na salita do sa Senate report, which again has to be examined, by the way. It's not a Senate report, actually. It's actually a report majority report ng isang committee sa Senado ng US. Kubaga you have a committee there, tapos yung, yung majority ng committee na yon, yung mga Democrats, ang ginawa nila, gumawa sila ng report, tapos nilabas nila. Now, that report, tandaan natin, walang participation ng minority, ah, ng Republicans. In fact, gagawa nga yung Republicans ang contra-report nila against it. So, pero kung, kung titingnan natin yung policy at yung definition ng, ng role talaga ng ginawa ng, ano, ng Bush administration, um, meron silang magandang argumento na pwede, pwede kayong mag-agree o pwede kayong hindi mag-agree pero ang punto doon is maganda yung position na sinabi nila na hindi naman to torture kasi para nga maging torture kailangan may permanent damage may, na, may talagang nabali na buto may nasira talaga na talagang permanento na mangyayari or sa psychological ng ano yung ginawa nila essentially is discomfort eh. uh, hindi, hindi siya katulad yung waterboarding hindi ito katulad yung kay Lorenzo Ruiz na pinoforce feed yung tubig it's essentially para mang nagkakaroon siya ng discomfort na parang feeling mo na hindi ka makahinga. Um, may mga American citizens na sumali sa Al-Qaeda na nagbigay ng order si, si Obama na i-drone attack. And this is on record. You can actually just Google it anytime. And you have to consider American citizen to, di ba? So if they committed an act against the interest ng U.S., then it's treason. Which means that they should be put on trial first before they're actually killed. In this case, hindi eh. Um, and so, ano ba mas masakit? Yung mino-waterboard ka or pinatay ka? <laughs>